I'm Bill Sisson, the, the editor of Angler Journal. I'm here with my colleague Dan Harding, the editor in chief of Power Motor Yacht, and our special guest is John Bayless of Bayless Boat Works. Hi, John. How you doing? Good. We're here at the uh, Custom Shootout in Marsh Harbor. Very exciting weekend. Yeah. Like 70, 60 of the best custom boats in the world are here for this. Yep. You've been building boats and running boats for decades. You've seen the change. You've seen them get faster, more sophisticated. Uh, more technology, larger. Tell me a little bit about that transition with your, you know, with your company. Well, we're uh, we just turned 16 years old uh, this past month. When we first started in 2002, we were going to build just really high-end, very efficient sport fishing boats, and that size back then was going to be something between 60 and 65 feet, 68 maybe. So we built our shop, it was 76 feet from end to end, inside. Said, we'll never build anything bigger than that. Maybe someday somebody might want a 70 foot. Well, here we are now, we just went through a 77 footer, and now we're, we're sitting around here, fishing all day, talking, laughing, having a good time. But yeah, this seems like a very normal size now. But things have changed, you know, the, the engine packages we get now are very efficient. They're, they've got a lot of power, there's no smoke, they spool up faster so you can maneuver on a fish. So there's been big improvements there, and then you throw in hydraulic bow thrusters and sea keepers, so Stable it's been fishing. a huge, yeah, it's been a, it's been a huge change. It's been since. quite a ride, hasn't it? It has, it's been interesting. So what comes through is a real passion for building product passion for fishing too. I mean, you still yeah. you still like to fish. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's a very important part of what we do. I think you know any custom builder here that you talk to will say that he has a certain passion for the build, but a lot of them have a passion for the fishing too. What a privilege it is for us to be able to build a boat like this, a machine, mm -hmm. 77 feet long, completely custom by hand, and uh, and then take that thing fishing and hopefully do well. I mean, you That's know, you gotta pinch yourself sometimes. Yeah. As good as it really gets, good. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Way, way better than I could have dreamed, mm -hmm. you know, when we started. Mm -hmm. It takes the, the owners to push it and to believe in it, and you know, to give you the opportunity to say, okay, this is what we want to create. Can you make it happen? Then you got to have the people that can help you do that. Sure. As, I mean, John, they, your product speaks for itself. You build absolutely beautiful boats, but I mean, what's what's the secret ingredient? What what happens behind the scenes that makes Bayless special? Well, the number one ingredient is, you know, just like I mentioned, the people. Um, over the years, over 16 years, we started with six of us. Six guys trying to build a boat. We were all doing it. Well, here comes the next order. And we got a little bigger. And there were these plateaus. Well, now we're at close to 100 people. But it's been a slow, you know, when you think about 16 years, that's not many people to add. But we've got people that are there now over 15 years. Wow, a lot of them that are 10. But to keep that core group together that has that passion, you know, we're very, uh, I guess we're, it's almost like a boot camp to get in there. Not like it's in a bad way. Like an apprenticeship? They, they have to prove themselves, and I, I'm looking more for desire and ability and drive to want to be the best. Because that's what that's what we're all, you know, we're all trying to do. We, we want to be the best whether we're fishing a tournament or building a boat, and those two go together. But when you got people with you, and you're all pulling the same way, it's, Ideas flow, uh, the efficiency flows, and you just get better and better and better. That's one thing we really stick to is trying to be in a constant state of improvement all the time. Well, it, it's, it's evident. And uh, with that, you want to stay tuned. We have an exciting photo essay in the upcoming issue of Power Motor Yacht that will actually follow the build of Bayless from initial wood delivery to final finished product. And it's it's really something special to see how these boats come to life. I think I think John Jr. said you guys take big pieces of wood, cut them into smaller pieces of wood, then glue them into bigger pieces of wood. And you guys do a great job with that. <laughs> yeah, we try. It's quite a process. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you. Absolutely. Well, thanks, thanks a lot for your time. All right. Really yeah, appreciate it, John. Thank you, John. All right. Thank you. Yeah.